My first memories of the waterworks goes back to night about around 1984, 85. Uh, I was a little little kid uh, passing the the waterworks every day. Uh, the fountains that they used to have out front. We always pass the waterworks. Uh, going to my grandmother's house either on Sundays or we just going by there to see her and I would always ask like hey can we let's go play in the fountain and he would pull up in the parking lot uh, and just let me go and see the water just stand on the edge of the fountain and take pictures like it's many of pictures that he always used to take my dad would always tell me he was like you're gonna be you know at the waterworks Okay, I'm like, all right, that's that's fine. Like he he would he would always tell me that no matter what you're gonna be at the world. I'm like, okay. So September of twenty, uh, it was two thousand seven September. I got a phone call, and it was Miss Harris. She was a human resource. She had called. She was like, hey, you know, we do have a position open, and you know, we want to see if you're interested. I'm like, yeah, I'm interested. The current current position is a team lead of customer service. Uh, in this position, you deal mostly with uh, the customer service aspect, uh, helping agents uh, explain different scenarios and accounts. You know, helping customers uh, with the issues that they have, and dealing with uh, the everyday. Uh, issues with the with our water system, what questions they might have, leading them in the right direction, explaining uh, bit, the billing to them, uh, if they have you know any kind of leaks or or any kind of repairs that need to be done. Favorite part about it is knowing at the end of a phone call or a face-to-face -face interaction with a customer, knowing that their problem is solved and they're happy with the way the problem is solved. The biggest advice I can give, don't be afraid to not only ask questions, but don't be afraid to challenge yourself. Push yourself to the past comfort. Uh, a lot of times as, as a young person, especially nowadays, we, we're satisfied with just comfort. Comfort is only good for, for sleeping. <laughs> that's it. That's the only thing comfort is good for. 